Well, if you still need to sign up for health care, this one is for you. United Way of Dane County hosted Super Saturday to help people get enrolled in health care insurance plans to fit their family's needs. And News 3's Valina Jones joins us now here with what you need to know before the February 15th deadline. And that's going to come quicker than we think. Yep, it's that time of year again. And the deadline to sign up for health care is almost here to make sure everyone is prepared. United Way and covering kids and families hosted an all day free enrollment event to encourage residents to know about their options. With the deadline of the Affordable Care Act looming around the corner. You know, I don't know which plan to choose and I, I want to go to stay with my own providers. How do I do that? There are a lot of questions for first time marketplace users. That am I choosing the right plan? So um, it's very difficult for me not having insurance and having to do it on my own. Maggie Zabinski is just one of the many Americans that will have to sign up for health insurance on her own this year. My current employer doesn't uh, pay for health insurance or doesn't offer health insurance, so I need to pay out of pocket. And I try to look online and I was just a little confused and need a little help, so. Lending a helping hand, United Way of Dane County and covering kids and families, spent the day answering questions and providing information to make sure everyone is covered. So it's really a matter of talking through your individual family scenario, plugging it into that marketplace and finding the best plan for you and your family that fits your budget and covers all the benefits that you need. The fact that this is now in the hands of the consumer and they have to be proactive, it's, you know, we need to get them as much help as possible. Dane County residents might even get to keep some extra change in their pockets through UW Health and United Way's Health Connect, a program that pays consumers premiums. Lowering their out-of-pocket costs, you know, for the low, um, low-income consumer, it's, it's virtually wiping out their out-of-pocket it costs to obtain the plan. Regardless of where you live and what plans you think you may qualify for, Young says it's important to be informed before it's too late. We're telling everyone they should at least um, investigate and look at their options. We want to make sure people don't incur an additional cost when they're already having, you know, difficulties making ends meet. Now, besides receiving a fine, if you miss the February 15th enrollment date, another thing consumers should look out for are potential changes to your income tax from your 2014 health coverage. Healthcare.gov says consumers will have to provide additional information when filing their federal income tax returns. You may also have to complete new tax forms and get a health coverage exemption or pay a fee with your tax returns. Now, United Way of Dane County is also encouraging residents to call their referral service at 211 to be connected to the proper resources to sign up for health care. With new rules come new reminders. Exactly. Now. A lot of stuff to be informed about. Absolutely. Valina, thank you so much for mm -hmm. all that tonight.